Hey there, readers of Top Speed. Thanks for checking out The Car Show, Wednesday nights on speed. Keep driving. Hey, it's The Car Show. Yeah. We're happy to welcome one of the winningest racers of all time. That's right. I love this man. And uh, Matt, I know you're a big fan as well. The great <laughs> Steve Millen, everybody. Great to see you, Steve. So much for coming, Steve. Steve is uh, a great guy, a winning racer. Steve, let's get into your history for a second. I know you're Australian. New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> I just doing that. It's not good, is it? No. Loves that. <laughs> now I'm just screwing with him. Uh, New Zealand, but how, how do you get started? Is racing big in New Zealand? It is. It's only a small country and only four million people. But um, a lot of good racing car drivers have come out of New Zealand. Like Most Denny, of them have your Denny last Hall. name. <laughs> right. There's a lot of millions. Yeah. Yeah. But um, no, we were brought up on a farm and started racing go-karts and graduated into hill climbs and sprint events and then into racing. Now you have uh, just a massive racing family. As I just said, your brother Rod, yeah. your nephew Reese, yeah. and, uh, and now your son Kyle, who, I, who is the coolest kid ever, is getting into racing too. Yeah, he he's, really he's got the family. He's built a little car and he's ready to go. And Basically what this guy does, what his company does, is you get your Nissan Z car, or your Infiniti G35, get that thing on eBay like three years old for 10 grand, yeah. take it over to this guy, give him five grand, and he'll put 500 horsepower under the hood of that V6, yeah? That, that's right. That's right. And a lot of people just go straight to a dealer, buy the car, bring it to us, and do the same thing. But simply with a supercharger, you can get 500 horsepower of that little V6 engine. So they really perform well. Yeah, it's a, it's a good car. I was at Stillen's place for a uh, cookout. Uh, I don't know how to, I just have low self esteem, but I just came over there on a Saturday <laughs> for a cookout, and he took his uh, Z car and he threw it up on the dyno, right. and he was gonna see if we could get 800 horsepower Which one, your, out of it. Your race car? It. The, the 75 MZ oh, car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, except for the thing had so much power that the rear tires couldn't hook up really? on the barrels mm. of the dyno. Oh, that's cool. right. Yeah, but um, good experience. And uh, Steve, uh, worst crash? Road Atlanta in 1995. That was your, that's your, was your professional racing career ender crash, right? It was, yeah. it was. So, you know, we were going really quick down the back straight and a, a guy with a lot of money, had a Ferrari, um, hit me as we went into the king at about 200 mile an hour and I went off the road and the end result was a broken neck. So you would, you would characterize Ferrari drivers as particularly terrible then, right? No, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> oh, oh, I have a professional racing question. Why grass? off the pavement because I see cars speed up yeah. when they hit the grass. Like yeah. they're, they're hanging on, on on the asphalt and then they hit the grass and it's like fast forward yeah. into the wall. But it looks good on TV, doesn't it? The contrast. I, I know, but take some gravel and paint it green. <laughs> well, the tracks in like Dubai and stuff, all the runoff is all tarmac, which I think yeah. helps. Tarmac's the best thing for slowing it down yeah. off the track. Right. But so I think the gravel's you, you, not much you, better either. You hit the wall, so you go off the track at 200, you speed up on the grass to 210, yeah. 225, <laughs> you hit the wall, break your neck, helicoptered out. Right. And uh, how many months in the hospital? Actually, I was only in the hospital about a week, but I had this halo contraption bolted to my skull and so on for three months, uh, you know, yeah. and I couldn't drive. I had to be driven around, and I hated that. Matt had that except for braces in junior <laughs> high. <laughs> oh, very uncomfortable. It was really I had lowered. to get the double XL for my head. It, was, it, it was really awful. lowered his self-esteem. All right, well, I know you've retired from professional racing, but how about a little amateur racing over here at our slot car set? You want to try that, Steve? Who am I racing against? You're racing against the great Dan Neal. Has he had some practice? You better get your uh, Hans device here. Yeah, it's yeah. going to get ugly. Now, yeah. Steve didn't have any practice, and Steve is, um, I'll just call him a competitor. I have no illusions. Uh, I'm yeah. going to lose. All yeah. right. Steve, you ready? I'm ready. You don't really care about Dad. Ready? Yeah. I'm going. I'm already oh. ready. Oh. by a country mom. One more lap, lap. Oh, 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 o